This is one of two majestic waterfalls in the Buang region of Buloro that will be used to generate electricity. The Chinese contractor that's building this hydropower project expects the plant to produce up to four megawatts of electricity. The plant will be partially owned by the local people. It's an ambitious dream that is slowly being constructed. We're inviting a Chinese company to come into joint venture with the landowners and they will produce power. Now out of that mountain the water is coming down. I think the head is about, uh, the water head is about 400 meters. This is the second waterfall. A dam will be built 400 meters above it. Here's another shot of the same spot. From that 400 meter elevation, engineers will tunnel through the mountain on the left and channel the water to turbines that will generate the power. And as you can see down there, there's uh, machines working down there. Uh, there's clearance already on the, on the bottom part of the mountain for the um, uh, construction workers to come and stay. And there's some, also some houses already built at the bottom there if you look down. But um, what I'm saying is that I'm trying to make Bololo district become a uh, power garden. Buang is rugged and mountainous. The people live in hamlets, in the valleys and on the ridges. Either by design or due to existing flaws, the public service machinery isn't working to full capacity. So the local politician has become both the legislator and the bringer of services. Look at Lo Buang now. I have to come back here to, you know, kick the asses to make sure that the machine is on the road. But really it's very hard. We traveled for an hour to the Buang interior. Here in this village using PNG government money, the district has brought electricity to village homes like this one for the first time. The electricity supply is coming from the main PNG power grid. Electricians are connecting power to 50 houses here and dozens more in other villages. Both goes to the one of the light outside. The other one goes to the light inside. And the other one goes to the bedroom. And the other one is for jug, a computer, or whatever appliance they want to use. The district is working to get the basics right, a usable road, power, landlines, and mobile communications and internet. In 13 months, the people here will be part owners to a power station. Scott Wyde, National MTV News, Lay.